Welcome back. Metalbati is one of the rarest panchayats which treats garbage from the village on its own. The panchayat has installed a recycling unit in the village. This panchayat has also been awarded the best panchayat recognition. Watch achievements and future plans of Metalbati panchayat in our panchayat report series Satagra. This is the Betalbhati Panchayat, a panchayat ruled by Miguel Pereira for eight years with the support of MLA Miki Pacheco. This is one of the rarest panchayat that treats their own garbage. Have a look at this. This is the recycling unit installed in the panchayat area. The panchayat has been awarded with the best panchayat award. recycling station ekam <laughs> Sarpanch claims that neighboring panchayats visit Betal Bhati to study system of garbage treatment. Sandorso, here Gauntelu Gingayon, Epurun, Aplamla Gavan, Tau Gelata. This panchayat houses a sub health center, sub post office, and has many proposed developmental plans. After the upcoming Panchayat poll, Panchayat will have a Lady Sarpanch following a reservation policy. A reporter from Betalbhati, Savio Das. The Parikar government is likely to complete the construction of Mopa Airport by 2015. On Monday, the CM met the consultant for the construction of the airport at the Secretariat. During the meeting, the master plan was approved in principle. Parikar said that by September end, global tenders will be floated. Already 80% of the land acquisition process has been completed. The project is being built on a PPP model. time schedule tender September end or tentative schedule Global tender float Global tender. investment invest global tender there are so many people who are interested. I presentation dila. Now that master master plan praha. So sakala plan in next two ten to twelve days we will approve it. It is now in principle it is approved, but it has to be studied. Ne? So once it goes to the file, it will be studied and approved in next ten to twelve days. Ani September end par in global tender ya approve kado. Target two thousand five hundred. It's a PPP project? It is greenfield, completely uh, private sector. Government will have only the land holding as its share. Okay, and what about land acquisition has been complete? Almost 75 80 percent is complete. Thank One God. small uh, component of it is Thank in the How about the finances? Was this finances of the airport? Complete to a 2045 per India projection, that is about 3,800 crores. But first phase will be about 2,500 to 3,000. Uh, that means to make it operational around 2,500 crores will be the cost. A reporter from Panji Lokik Shilkar, video journalist Omkar Falari. Seems like everything isn't well inside the newly renovated Ravindra Bhavan at Margao. Artists have to face a lot of problems while performing at this theatre in the commercial capital. They claim even after renovation there are no proper facilities for artists and the roof is already leaking much before the monsoons. Ravindra Bhavan was renovated in November to host the International Film Festival of India. Though it looks well maintained, it's just superficial. Have a look, there are no proper facilities to the artist. No stand for costumes, no proper sitting arrangements and non-maintained floor. Moreover, before monsoon, the roof has started leaking. I am here in the hall. 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 I am 
पूण आज ते सगळे ताणी बदलप केलां आणि काही सदमान हांगा सगळ्यात कळटा पावसाच्या दिसांत तर हांगा रावपाचेच ना सगळे लीक जाता आणि उदक भर येऊन आमकां खूप त्रास जातात हे आता ताणी इतलो डिस्पेस करून हे हॉल केला इम्प्रुवमेंट जाऊंक जाय आसलो बरो सुधारप जाऊंक जाय आसलेले ते सुधारप जावचे भोलदेक सगळ्यांच वायटू जावं जाला ते ग्रीन चेडवांचे ग्रीन रूम आसात तुय त्योच प्रॉब्लेम झालेले असतात It's not even 6 months after the renovation but have a look at the Ravindra Bhavan this has raised many questions on the quality of renovation work a reporter from Madgaon Savio Dais The celebration of the Milagres feast at Mapsa was on Monday this is one of the biggest festivals in Mapsa city devotees from all walks of life visit the church to take blessings of Sai Bain The celebration of one of the most famous feasts in the state Mapsa's Milagres feast began from Monday. Catholics celebrate this feast of Mother Mary as Milagres Saibin in Mapsa. Saibin is offered coconut oil. It is believed that Saibin fulfills wishes of her devotees and with this faith thousands of devotees flock here for her blessings. <laughs> भैणी <laughs> आणि थिंगाचे तेल ते हिंगा उडून घालता सायबिणी आणि हिंगाचे मोगरीचे कळे ते थिंगा उडून घालता सायबिणी म्हणजे आपल्या भयणीक असे म्हणते The Transport Department has also drafted a comprehensive Goa school bus rules on the lines of rules framed by Maharashtra and Kerala. The government has also appointed Central Road Research Institute to study traffic and transportation in Goa. CRRI will submit report by the 30th of June. The Director of Transport informed this to the High Court on Monday. School children were drowned to death in a tragic bus accident at Kalvi Aldona on 18 February. High Court had taken so much cognizance of traffic management in Goa. The Suo Moto petition on traffic management in Goa came up for hearing before the Goa bench of Bombay High Court on Monday. Director of Transport Arun Desai has filed affidavit in the High Court giving details of the measures taken by the Transport Department to prevent accidents in the state after the ill-fated accident at Kalving. Transport Department has also drafted comprehensive Goa school bus rules on lines of rules framed by Maharashtra and Kerala. The rules have been submitted to the government for approval. Transport director says DOT drafted comprehensive Goa school bus rules rules forwarded to government for approval enforcement of GSBR immediately after government's approval life stage of carriage permit buses maximum 15 years buses above 15 years to be off the road within 3 years central road research institute to study transportation in goa crri to submit report by 30th june process to construct kalvi bridge began tenders floated tender opening fixed on 7th may transport route in two categories main route tertiary routes frequent checks to be carried out at accident prone zones a reporter from panji navdeep agyar it's time now for another short break stay tuned